I did also speak earlier to somebody who's been a very key player in all of this, and that is Sushil Kumar Modi of the BJP, who's now the Deputy Chief Minister of Bihar. And uh, I began by, of course, congratulating him on becoming Deputy Chief Minister, but also to ask you, Mr. Modi, that this was not a mandate for you this time. This was a mandate for the JDU and for the RJD. Aren't you simply trying to enter or grab power through the back door? So the mandate was not for Benami Sampatti. The mandate was not for to compromise but with, the, not, with the corruption. But it was so the kind of uh, the the way in which. Uh, but it was. But it was not for the BJP either. The mandate was not for the BJP either. No, but the people of Bihar they wanted BJP JDU to come together because they found that it was a mistake on their part to bring back again Lalu Prasad Yadav. And in the way in which in the last hundred days the scams, the Benami deals were exposed and they were unable to answer a single charge. So the people of Bihar they felt that now the time has come that BJP, JDU earlier also when they were together, right. they gave a good government in Bihar. No, but sir, so again they wanted a good governance in Bihar. So but sir, I just want to ask you, wanted, I just want to ask want you, I just want to ask you that some would say that this is now a pattern that we are seeing with the BJP, whether it's Goa, whether it's Manipur and now in Bihar, you don't win elections but you break alliances using muscle power, money power or just simply the power of the centre. So where is the question of money power in Bihar? Where is the question of muscle power in Bihar? The money power and muscle power was, was with the RJD. There was a party of goons, there was a party of corrupt people, there was a party who grabbed, uh, who grabbed Benami lands. And see, one big thing is that if Lalu Yadav has their family, if they have Benami Sampatti, then this alliance would have continued. This alliance broke, uh, broke okay. because of the sin of Lalu Prashad Yadav and his family. No, but I just want to the ask way, you. The people were... Okay, I just yes. want to ask you the manner, okay, you're saying the sin of Lalu Yadav, but I want to ask you the manner in which it happened. Was this entirely a pre-planned exercise? So how it was pre-planned? For the last 20 days, the Janta Dari was demanding explanation from Tejasvi Prashad Yadav. If they could have explained, they, they, could, uh, they could come before the media and tell the details about their Benami transactions, this uh, alliance could have been continued. Mm. So, for the last 20 days, Nitish Kumar and his party, they were demanding, come in the no, public domain and explain. So, if they not explain, the government fell down. Why no, is the Sushiji. peace planning? Because they put a condition for continuance of this, uh, of this alliance. No, please uh, listen, Srinivasan Jain, please listen. अगर उन लोगों ने जवाब दे दिया होता और नीतीश कुमार सर डेट आई विल नॉट कॉम्प्रोमाइज ऑन द इश्यू ऑफ करप्शन ही सेड डेट आई यू विल हैव टू कम एंड एक्सप्लेन अगर उन्होंने ये एक्सप्लेन किया होता तो एलाइंस नहीं ब्रेक करता ओके बट लेट मी आस्क यू दिस दैट वाज दिस डिसीजन टेकन बाय यू अलोंग विद � See the Bihar MLAs when we surveyed, we, when we talked to the Bihar MLAs, 100% MLAs, they were in favor of alliance with the JDU. And we conveyed the feeling of, uh, uh, of our workers, of our MLAs to the center leadership. And when they gave a, gave a green signal, then I talked to Nitish Kumar. And Nitish Kumar also on his 11th meeting, he gave the mood of his MLAs. And each and every MLA in JDU, they didn't want to continue this alliance with Lalu Prasad Yadav. And they said we want to break this alliance and we want to form government with the help of BJP. Right, but I just want to ask you something that you know you say that now Nitish Kumar is this wonderful person but if I want to just read out to you some of the things Nitish Kumar has said about Narendra Modi and vice versa. Nitish Kumar said the real Modi on display brazen attempt to add communal texture to Bihar polls but deafening uh, silence on the deplorable incidents of Dadri. This is something he said in 2015. Then he said first Lalit Modi and now Malia, Modi government is either clueless or purposely turning a blind eye. Whichever the case, such mishandling is worrying. Narendra Modi in his turn called JDU Janta Ka Daman or Utpidan Party. He also said that Jungle Raj in Bihar this time is like the experience of jail. To which Nitish Kumar said, Jo jail jate hai, they come back with lots of bad habits, referring to Amit Shah. 
This is the person now you've allied with. And see what position Lalu Yadav and Nitish Kumar has taken against each other uh, from 90 to 2005. So see these issues are not very relevant because today the people of Bihar they wanted a good governance. Right. They wanted that law and order should be under control. They wanted that Bihar should uh, develop. So they wanted a good growth rate in Bihar. Right. But listen, uh, you are saying this, uh, Sushil Kumar Modi, but Nitish Kumar left the NDA because Narendra Modi was made the Prime Ministerial candidate of the BJP. So these questions, I think it will be better if you ask uh, these questions from JDU, from Nitish Kumar. Only he can answer. I am not competent enough to answer these questions. Okay, I just want to ask you a simple question though that do you trust Nitish Kumar because he's left you in the past, he's now left Lalu Yadav, what's the guarantee he won't do it again? Do you trust him? Pura viswas, pura bharosa rakhte hain aur pura viswas karte hain aur mein yeh viswas dilana chahunga ki baaki bache 40 vayna mil kar sarkar chalayenge aur bihar mein behtar saashan denge aur dada 19 ka chanao dono mil kar sweep karenge we will win 40 out of 40 lok sama seats in bihar with the icon with the icon of narendra modi and development icon of nitish kumar